Okay, I was talking a second ago about the modification to this uh, speech synthesizer with this button back here. What that button does is it basically resets the computer without having to turn it off and then back on again. So it does pretty much that without having to do it. Uh, that's about it. <coughs> the uh, next thing I wanted to talk about are these cartridges. Um, I have a variety of cartridges. Some are kind of cool. Um, some are, you don't see a whole lot, but uh, for the most part, they're just, you know, cartridges everybody's got. Um, some of them are, are pretty important. I talked a little bit about the, the uh, um, TI Extended Basic cartridge. I want to talk a little bit more about that. Um, here's a copy of the TI Extended Basic cartridge. And that's basically a programming language. Um, it's not a game or anything like that. Uh, but it's used for so much more. Here's the uh, the manual for it, TI Extended Basic, and here's the software box that it came in. Um, another t another application um, cartridge is the Terminal Emulator 2. This uh, I'll talk more about this in another video, but this really kind of changed the face of the way uh, people connected with each other. Um, we'll talk more about that. But there are those cartridges that are um, kind of special, uh, and, and TI Logo 2 is the same way. Um, they're used to run other programs, and we'll be doing a lot of stuff on Extended Basic, so you'll be able to see that. These are all educational programs over here in this box. But um, you can, there are so many different formats for the for the TI-99 um, programs. There, you know, there's the cartridges, there's the discs, and then the cassette recorder, which I don't have hooked in right now. Um, I haven't used it in a, in a while since I've got my disk manager. But now I got diskette software, programming aids. These are all things that you're going to need. Um, most of the programs that I have on disk are you need require the extended basic cartridge. There's another one um, to to run it. So if you do have those cartridges, you will probably need them if we go through any tutorial stuff. Uh, so get them ready and tune back in.